what's up guys NS Relapse here and we're gonna be doing a quick debate so as you guys saw if any of you guys saw the Keemstar versus SB Scars debate um, I agree with Keemstar on a lot of the ideas and a lot of the things that he was saying and Nemo Cat is defending SB Scars because he feels that uh, that Keemstar shouldn't have said a lot of the things or done a lot of the things that he you know did so we're gonna start off so Nemo Cat what do you think that Keemstar did wrong alright so for starters guys I think he basically just fucked over his whole team I mean everyone looked up to Thrust I mean everyone liked Thrust who cares about the fucking views views don't really matter as long as you're bringing out content that you like uh what he should have did was Keemstar should have basically told them like Two months ahead of time, okay, you guys should be looking for a new team, blah, 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 because... Okay, okay. I agree with that. I agree with what you said. Hold on, let me interrupt you real quick. I agree with what you said that Keemstar should have, um, you know, gave them like a two month period where, okay, I'm going to be changing this clan up. We're going to be doing something a little bit different because, you know, we're not getting as big as, you know, we want to. And I'm that type of person that, you know, wants to get a channel big. I'm, I'm not going to, you know, score for something low. I want to get big. I want to get out there. I want to have the new big idea. That's what I think, um, you know, Keemstar was kind of going with it. But, you know, I kind of agree that he should have, um, he should have, you know, gave him a two-month grace period where, hey, guys, you know, we're going to be switching this shit up completely in two months. You guys should definitely go, you know, make your um, make your own teams or uh, join a team. But, yeah, what, what else were you going to say? Okay, so I think switching up the channel was probably a fucking mistake. I mean, I know he created the channel with Mala. It's not Mala, just saying. But uh, he created the channel with Mala, and... He shouldn't have switched it up on everyone because everyone loved Thrust for the sniping. You completely convert the channel into knifing. It's like saying that, I don't know, like, you're going to uh, kill somebody. I don't know. That's a horrible metaphor. No, okay, what I what I think that, Ma, or what, not Mala, <laughs> what I think Keemstar, what I think Keemstar is doing is, or what I think he should do, I don't know if he wants to make this clan that, um, that you know, he's creating Thrust into or whatever. I don't know if he wants to make it into an only knifing team, but... I don't agree with only knifing. What I think he should do is, um, you know, convert it into something with, you know, sniping once in a while. Convert it into something with maybe, you know, what he kind of said in the video, a little bit of RC where someone, you know, uses an RC, blows up, fucking someone else snipes the RC, blows up, gets like a fucking quad. I think something like that or throwing up a C4 and shooting it and fucking getting like a quad or something like that. Even, um, even crazy shit with Predator missiles. I don't know, just... I think uh, what he's, I don't think he wants to do only knifing. I think that he wants to, you know, do something completely different from the trick shotting and the feeding thing because everybody's doing that. Everybody looks up to FaZe. You know, no one's going to get bigger than FaZe. Sorry to tell everybody, no one's going to get bigger than FaZe unless FaZe, you know, starts fucking losing interest in what they're doing. What happened? Hold on. Um, I don't think that Phase is gonna, you know, step down because they're coming out with fucking great ideas that supports their cause, and I think that they're gonna just stay up there. I don't think that any other team is gonna, you know, get close to Phase because, as you see, teams fucking end up breaking up, players leave, fucking channels get hacked or whatever you guys want to call it, and you know, teams end up going to the second and third generation. Like Dare, Dare would have like 500 plus, so 500. K plus subscribers if you know they didn't fucking end their channel three times or two times they're on their on their third channel right now and you know they'd be the closest to phase but Clay, phase is about to hit two million subscribers that's that's four times as much like there's no competition that's close as phase and what Keemstar I think is trying to do is I think he's trying to create the new idea like do you guys know about that one guy um I forget his name only Mr. fucking knife I don't know his name he has like 500k subs or whatever you guys know his name? Something with the blade. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, use me blade or some shit like that. I don't know. Okay, he has 500k subs. Um, you know, he, he it's a one man channel. He fucking does videos on only knifing. I think Keemstar, you know, saw that he had 500k subs. All he does is knifing. Hey, we, you know, we're gonna convert. Fucking, we're gonna make a new. We're gonna make the new thing. And I think that Keemstar just, you know, just not only knifing. I think that he should throw in some other shit and. That'd be fucking fun as fuck to lead. I would help him lead that shit. 
I don't know, but if Keemstar, if you're hearing me, hit me up. Well, of course you would help him leave because you're a fucking loner, which you would have. Shut the fuck up, dude. I think of ideas and your ideas, ideas like that are amazing. Help, help. Okay, so what was your next thing? What was your next thing that you wanted to fucking talk about? No, hold on, hold on. I'm still talking. No, I'm still talking. Okay, so, Garrett's probably one of the two biggest teams in the fucking fucking media. A7 and SP. Coming from Scarce's perspective, Garrett's Talk up, wait, speak up, speak up, speak up. You fucking idiot. Speak but, up. Uh, shut up, I'm not done talking. But it's my turn to talk. So, Scarce is like, he, his commentary, about Team Star, we sort of write about it because, I mean, if you have friends in there, teams are like, we're developed for friendship. Like, people, yeah, money's gonna like attract people, but I mean, if you, why would you stick playing a game if you didn't, like, make money off of it? Like, please stay playing that me. Like, that's why we have YouTube permissions. That's why Thrust is partnered. You make money off of Thrust, for example. So, who fucking cares? Okay, well, I think the reason why he wants to turn into something else is because he wants to be fucking a leader like Temper. Temper created a fucking amazing idea, or he didn't create it, but he was, he was given leadership to... A really good idea really early in the production of that idea which uh, made fucking phase 2 million subscribers fucking 100k plus upload views every video he wants to do something like that he wants to come out with the next big fucking thing and if you can it all has to be within a team it can be you know it could be a player kind of like Zero Grizz or something where you do a crazy ass idea by yourself but it's not gonna get as big fast enough because you're gonna have to do the content all by yourself it, it like it, as a team if you have 10 people that you know think that this is a fucking amazing idea which there should be because if you honestly think about it if people do montages episodes on crazy shit on Call of Duty that you know that you don't see regularly because you know YouTube feeding and trick is getting kinda old that's why maybe you know some viewers you know don't watch anymore because it's getting old it's been out for what two two years almost three years now you know that's kind of getting old it's getting old you know he wants to come out with a new idea that that's gonna lavish that's gonna fucking pop you know that's gonna be the next big thing okay. that's why he wants to do with it but I, I completely agree with you he should have given the team a two-month grace period telling them hey you know we're gonna switch that completely the complete idea of what we're doing right now to something else 100% different so if you guys want to leave you know leave now because I'm gonna start recruiting players I think that's what should he have should have done uh, or, or they should have had the team but it's like the team basically the foundation of the clan so the members are the ones that basically build the team so oh, I completely he, agree he, he started to help make the creative videos the fucking players and editors do all that shit team start the only reason they the only reason that what? So the only reason that he would like want to convert the channel is because yeah, the views suck. I mean, but the yeah, getting views two thousand. Look, Mala Mala came from fucking phase. He has I don't know how many subs on his channel. I haven't checked last, but he has a shitload of subs on his channel. He made a team and he wanted that team to get fucking huge. And two thousand views on a video, trying to fucking compare yourself to phase is a fucking laugh in the face yeah, well, he, that's why he fucking gave layer shit to keemstar and keemstar what he's trying to do is he's trying to fucking bring the name thrust fucking he's trying to get that huge and that's what he's trying to do he's trying to convert something new or something old into something new he's trying to you know be the fucking leader of the new idea like you gotta okay, think I'm about it you gotta yep. think about it like this phase when temper when temper made phase he fucking he fucking what? There was only fucking like two or three trick shot clans, YouTube teams at the time that do the the you know the same thing that he does, or the same thing that Phase does. And now you know there's teams everywhere. There's two and there's fucking Super. Well, Super has been doing it for a long time too. But you know you gotta agree with me. There's a lot of teams that do it now, and it's all because of Phase because Phase started it. Okay, well that's basically the same thing as Night Team. You have a well, no. Yo, oh, speak up, speak up, hold on, hold on, hold on. One more thing. Hold on, hold on. But teams are basically didn't develop the whole fucking Nike thing. You have teams like fucking Amp and SJMX and all that shit, and they fucking developed the Nike community. Not fucking Keemstar. I no, I know, I know, but you know, Keemstar, Keemstar is yeah. heading for that idea that he wants to create something new and get it huge. You see all these other teams like creating like a certain type of team top. Like you have Arrow with a team top called Eternity, Obey with a team top called Infinite. It's based on something. Why doesn't Thrust just do that? 
That will give you and more views, more hype, more motivation. Are so you talking about a, a new channel? Viewers. Wait, are you talking about like Keemstar should have made a new channel for the no, team? No, should have made a fucking team talk those veins off of something. And like how Aaron does and how Obey's doing it. And it's all kind of. Alright, give me an example. Give me an example like what? So, Obey has this team talk that they've been working on, edited by Abby and a few other editors. He did the trailer. Like, they had a. It's, it's an awesome trailer. It's like based off of Bioshock and all that. All yeah. That. Called Obey Infinite. Uh, then you have Era. They have a team talk trailer called Eternity. That's yeah. like hype shit. That's basically bringing the team back up because like, everyone's looking forward to their team talk. Yeah. And so frustrated with that because that probably would have brought in more hype, more motivation, and everyone probably would wanted to join Thrust after they've seen the content you guys were able to bring out. So you think that they should have just created new content that no one's seen before? Yeah, they should have tipped their ideas. But but wait, do you do you think that do you think that they should have stayed a trick shotting team, a YouTube team? Yeah, team. whatever ideas they had, they could have improved the product. I know, but the thing is with that is it's hard to come up with new ideas. Like, no, I mean, no, it's it, not hard to come it, up with new it, ideas, it, but it's gonna take a extra. It's gonna take extra effort because people have already done all these ideas with episodes. Um, kind of how Banks made that one idea with uh with Soar, uh, crashing in style. You can't do that anymore because that'd be you know considered fucking taking their idea. Well. You would have to come out with something, you, you would have to think of an idea that's out of the box for it to be good in this community, and Keemstar doesn't want to do that. Keemstar wants to have a fresh start in his idea, and he wants to get that idea big, which I completely agree is going to get big if he stays into it. Hold on, hold on. If you wanted a fresh start, if you just said fresh start, that's exactly what I'm trying to prove. If you wanted a fresh start, I'd make a new damn channel. Make no, I completely piece. agree. He should have, he should have, you know, either made a new channel or, you know, did that thing that I said, the grace period. But, you know, a lot of people aren't fucking, a lot of people are, you know, lazy. And he probably didn't want to go through making a completely new promo. Because he already, he, look, he already had all of his subscriber count. He had a subscriber count. All he has to do is make a video saying, hey, you know, this channel is going to change. Like the video that he did. He, he, you know, he told the subscribers, you know, this channel is going to change. We're going to do something new. He probably didn't want to make a completely new channel with zero subscribers. You know, and only well, get like 2,000 subscribers and start off like that. He already had a, you know, base. He, he saw that the team already had 60K subs. They were only getting 2,000 views. Once he made that video, that shit got 20,000 views. That's fucking, that's 10 days of fucking videos for it to get that many views in one video. Alright, so, if you just said, you just said he had a bunch of connections. If he had a bunch of connections, you should have made a new damn channel. Make common sense. You would have a fresh subscriber. Yeah, I know, but... All that shit. How do you yeah, know Thrust is going to be active? Thrust is probably going to be more inactive than what it is now. Yeah, but you got to think about it, too. A lot of people thought that a lot of teams were going to be inactive. I, I can't really think of the top of my yeah, head, but... they but... stick with trick shotting. That's the problem. They stick with trick shotting and, and sniping. Yeah, but if you stick with something that's already been created, then you're just following. Like, do you want to be a follower? Do you want to create a new idea that no one's done and then create followers that follow you? When people come into this community, like, you run SOP. You create an SOP from the bottom up, right? Yeah. Okay, so you have fucking e sniping, okay, for example. They're basically fucking taking your idea and... Shit their it. idea, their idea is hard scoping. Like uh, my community doesn't hard scope. We we um we give people well, we give people it, warnings it, for hard scoping. Two hard scopes is what DQ in a game. In e sniping, you could hard scope all you fucking want. That's the reason I don't like it is because I'm trying to gain more skill. Like the people in SLB, what what like my goal is is for everybody that does you know YouTube teams or whatever to use SLB as a way to get better at quick scoping or just to play for fun or to you know join our tournaments that's the reason I made SLB was for people to you know increase their skill in quick scoping not hard scoping because anybody could hard scope I could give the fucking controller to my best friend Ricky and fucking tell him to hard scope and he'll be able to hard scope in fucking no time he'll be able to get a fucking quad feed if it lines up for him perfect enough quick scoping on the other hand I think is more of a um more of a skill because if you pick up the controller and you're brand new you know you're not you're not going to be able to quick scope you're going to have to get take a week off fucking start practicing do whatever you want if you want to get good at it yeah but you're basically being a follower still you have all these fucking you're saying that 
day. No, I know, but that's what I that's what I expect. Uh, that's what I made SLB for. I'm not trying to, you know, do it for the fucking views, do it for the followers. I am doing it for the followers and all that shit. That's what um that's why I keep on doing what I'm doing because they like it only quick scoping. If I convert it into hard scoping, they'd fucking hate it. They wouldn't they would rather follow e sniping if I made hard scoping. The reason I have the following on SLB that I do is because I, you know, made it quick scoping only. I made it, you know, with the rules that we did, and I've been following like following it like that for years. Well, I mean, you say like, okay, but back wait, 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 back to the back to the fucking main topic, Keemstar and Scars. So why do you agree with Scars again? I mean, I completely agree with some things that he says. Not completely, but you know, with some oh, things that he says. Scares. It's not scars, so I'm saying fucking scars. Okay, I just say it's safe, correct? Uh, so, scares. He's been a leader for about at least a year now, probably two years. I don't even know. I've been on scares for a long time. And I think he can do to a team. I see what he can work a team into. That's how E7 got to where it is today. A7's doing really fucking great. Even though he's not the founder of the fucking team, he still took it and made it like his own. And if Team Star could have did the same thing, like, he could have. As I said, he could have made new ideas. Like how you're saying he could have get the knife and shit. Nobody wants to watch fucking knifing. All you have to do is run around well, like, knife, dude, knife, 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 Like knife. I said in the beginning of this video. He probably didn't mean only knifing. I'm not sure if he means 100% knifing, but, you know, there's other fucking well, things that you can do. There's crazy ass shit that you can fucking think of or tell your players to do instead of only knife or instead of only knifing or trick shotting only or feeding only. So what Cause over time do? everything dies out. You're talking about you using always like have to, you shit. always have to fucking, you know, you always have to step it up every year you have to step it up because shit gets old and you know it's getting to that point where fuck dude this is kind of getting old we have to think of a new idea that's going to be com you know that's going to not be 100% completely different i mean you know trick shotting and feeding and the new idea would be perfect once in a while if it's a really fucking crazy clip that people are going to be like damn yeah let me watch that yo link me to that shit yeah let's watch it i completely agree with that idea Interesting. So, so if you're just saying Team Star is all you're saying, right? No, what I think is that he has a good idea. Yeah, you know, he, he, has, probably, yeah he probably he probably needs a little bit of help with that idea, and I'd be, you know, I'd fucking help him out with that idea. Okay, just I don't agree with a hundred percent of what he what he did, you know, with the thrust players and shit, because I do believe that those players were in there for what their what they fucking made their personal channels for, and what they made their content over was feeding and trick shotting. Alright, so you don't agree with me, okay. Uh, so yeah, I mean, until, like, I don't think, uh, it's kind of hard to say, but, uh, Team Star, like, came out of nowhere when Thrust started. Nobody knew who the fuck he was, I mean, because, Yeah, but I mean, Mala, like, Mala was the leader, and he oh, agreed Mala was to take Team Star under. Mala was the leader, Mala was all the fucking subs. I know, but Mala gave leadership to Keemstar, because he saw they that Keemstar obviously had something to bring to Thrust. Give it to him. What? They were both fucking leaders at the time. They created the fucking team together. I know, but look, if you saw the video, then Keemstar said in the video, Mala just wasn't fucking, he, he didn't see the results he wanted to see, so he gave me leadership, and, you know, Keemstar wants to change the view set, and he wants to get more views, so he's thinking of new ideas on how to do that. Because if you follow the same footsteps as other teams already, you're just going to fucking get low views. People want to see the best of the best when it comes to something. So that's why they're going to see, you know, okay, things. Because they want to see the best team hold on, hold on, perform hold on, hold on, at their best. Hold on. If he gave fucking Team Star fucking leadership, how the fuck did Majoro fucking use the channel? What are you and, talking about? Okay. Wait, repeat yourself. How? Okay, if he gave Team Star the channel... Or the leadership, whatever the fuck you're talking about. How did Magoo get the channel? How did who? Magoo get the channel. Who the fuck is that? Oh, you obviously don't know what the fuck you're talking about then. Magoo no, I don't know who the fuck Magoo is, but I, I, you know, I saw the video. Okay, what, do you what, you, what do you think that? What do you think this is about? This video is about a fucking. This is a response video on the video that he made. Yeah, and Magoo is a fucking leader. He fucked him over too. No. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So. I don't know if he was. I don't know if he had the same the same power as Keemstar as a leader. No, but Keemstar. Okay, so Mala gave Mala gave Keemstar fucking leadership 
overall so, leadership, so and then King Star got Star another Star leader. Star or how how is it established? Nemo, Nemo. That's hella shady. Nemo, what? All right. So when Molly gave leadership to King Star, did Molly give leadership to that other guy too? Yeah, basically. Madhu had access to the. Okay, fucking... but who was more of a leader? Like, who was the overall leader? Channel, but what you should have did was you should have talked to your players. Okay, yeah, I agree. Like I fucking told you earlier, <laughs> he should have done that. He well, should have gave him a grace period, or he should have fucking told them. In two months, we're gonna change channels. So if you want to leave, then you could leave, or if you want to stay, you could stay. In the video, he said that the players were lazy; they wouldn't been clicking the drop box. You have to fucking motivate them. You have to fucking make threats in Russia. That's yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I, com I completely agree. With the team, you have to fucking you have to be on top of the players. That's what the leader should do. That's what the owner should do. You should be on top of your players, and you should make sure that they do their job as a fucking as a player they should you know what what a leader supposed to do is they're supposed to manage everything on the fucking team yeah so and they're supposed to be active with it they're supposed to be active with their players they you know what what's the point of a team when the leader doesn't even know what fucking players are on the team you know you have to or or how they act or whatever you know you you want to engage with your players thank you Thank you, you just said it right there, thank you! Well, yeah, that's what I agree on that he should have fucking done, but, you know, he didn't, he's taking it in a different perspective, I agree with the perspective that he's taking it in, and, you know, it's a good idea, it's just that he, you know, whatever you want to call it, he fucked him over, I don't really... Well, he didn't really fuck him over, but at the same time, he, uh, he should have told them, that was really shady, that's all, I, that's all I'm saying, he told yeah. them, the one rule he said, you can't use a sniper anymore, you have to pick up a knife, that's what he strictly said. He didn't say anything else, so I think that as he wanted it to be a Nike team. What's well, yeah. that fucking bullshit? You might as well just go into fucking MLG or all that bullshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, some things aren't always as planned for people, but you know that's how it goes. You're just gonna have to deal with it. But um, besides that, do you have any other things that you want to back up Scars about? I mean, Scars is a really cool ass person. I have him added on Skype and everything. You know, I'm not saying that he, you know, he's wrong. I, you know, I agree with most of the shit that he said. Uh, well, in that debate, I think it was really fucking stupid. Uh, first off, how can you have a fucking 30-year-old man talking to a fucking 16-year-old and all that? How can you, I don't even see how that's even possible. Well, I don't know, I don't know if Keemstar, who, who was the one, who was the one that told the other person, let's have a fucking argument or let's have a discussion? Keemstar! All right, so Keemstar went to yeah, Scars. Hold on, towards the end of that debate, he told Skiff that he was bullying him. What the fuck? You're a grown ass. No, I know, I know, but who's the person that came to the other person and recorded it? Keemstar. Okay, well, I mean, did Scars fucking agree to it? Yeah, Apparently, he did. So, you know, what's the issue with it? Well, okay, you gotta think about it like this too. If I fucking ask you, hey, let's do an fucking let's do an opinion on something, That's it doesn't really matter. I mean, it would it's kind of double standards. It doesn't really matter what age you are, cause if I want to have a fucking conversation or my, I want to express my opinion with something with someone that's fucking 50 years old and I'm only 20 years old, uh -huh. I'm not going to fucking say, hey, you know, that's fucking, that's bullshit. He's 50 years old. He knows more. If I fucking start talking to you and I start giving my opinion, that's because I'm going to back it up. You know, age has nothing to do with this. There's people that are fucking 12 years old that I guarantee would beat you in a fucking opinion contest. Oh, uh, shut the hell up. <laughs> well, you gotta think about it like that, too. If I'm gonna fucking... If someone that if someone's 70 years old and they wanna have a fucking... And they wanna have an opinion well, on something, and, I ha and I'm strong about that opinion, I'm strong, I'm backing up my opinion, I'm gonna fucking give my opinion on it, and whether... I don't care how old he is, I'm gonna fucking express what I feel. Whether it's wrong or right. Alright, well. And that's what Scars did. So I don't think that age really matters in this. Alright, well, we're about to wrap this up. Yeah, okay. That was pretty much. Alright, guys. So that was pretty much the um, response video on Keemstar and Scars. Uh, if you guys haven't <laughs> seen that, we're going to link. We're gonna link it in the description below. Um, if anybody wants to, you know, if anybody, you know, that's in a big team or whatever wants to fucking start something up with me or Keemstar, I don't care who, because I think that, I want I want to do a new idea, I want to, you know, do something that's out of the box that people will actually, you know, watch more of, you know, just hit me up, my Skype is SLB. if you want to be a part of this news thing, uh, hit me up, 
Yeah, hit him off on Nemo Cat. Nemo Cat's uh, the other owner of this, and he agreed that you know he feels that Scars was right, but I feel that Keemstar was right on some things too. Don't get me wrong, I think Scars was right on a lot of things too. Yeah, well, so you know, we wanted to express our opinion, and this was our opinion. So, yeah, guys, give this a like. Make sure to give your opinion in the description below. This has been NS Relapse, Nemo Cat. Javo was, uh, you know, just hearing this out. So was Dreaded. Uh, yeah, guys, make sure to subscribe. Stay active. Peace. There's no hand in between this.